the rack with that connected. I'll put a Duracell in. I don't know if it's made, I don't know if it's made a difference. Maybe very slightly. I don't know, maybe it's a placebo effect. But I'll try, try and get it straight with my eye. Right, hold on. Uh, oh, the, well, at least the eye works anyway, eh? Oh dear, God, the little AI is quite... And that's not even the powerful one, but... I've knack, I've, well, I've sort of broken the AI. Uh, basically what it was, I was the switch had fallen off. And the switch contains, what is it, off, on, IR, low, well, low IR, and then high IR. Well, when I put it back on, it snapped the bloody Torx had sort of really thin, like half a mil bloody span, I think on the little grub screw so it snapped it inside and it was so the switch was then sort of in the wrong position so now it's just got on off low, low IR and high IR sort of you know not on it because the switch doesn't turn any further but anyway yeah it's good enough good enough actually let's just change our gun see you man there we go Oh god, it fucking flies and do my head in down here. Chewing on my nose. But anyway, that's uh Yeah, actually I think it is very, very slightly brighter with the Duracell over the Aquine. Very, very slightly maybe brighter. Yeah, it just seems to be. Weird. Uh, yeah, it's definitely Definitely. Or unless, of course, my eyes have just got adjusted. But that's a possibility, because I, I mean, I've been looking through the thermal with the left eye, but not my number right. So. Yeah, there's no... Oh, there is stars out. The stars are out. Right. Oh, that's cool. Wow. <laughs> it was overcast, and now it's fucking not overcast. Wow. That's mad. Well, I'll tell you what, we'll do a test. Let's just check that I'm recording. We'll do a test of the the other IR versus this IR. So let me just check that it's recording. I'll tell you what, I'll pause this.